Yes, my people, good day. Working on a Dodge today. Customer states cranks and will not start. So I checked fuel pressure at the rail. There's no fuel pressure at the rail. So I suspect the pump. But before I get to the pump and say, let's just put a pump in it, I want to check at the pump to make sure that I'm getting power going to the pump before I say, yeah, it needs a pump. So I went under there and took a look to see if I could reach on top of the fuel tank. And look what I saw. Super tight. No access, Mr. John. We can't get to it. And I'm looking and I'm looking. I can't really get to it because it's it tight in here. But this is where wiring diagrams come in. So I printed up a wiring diagram and I'm looking for the fuel pump. The fuel pump is down here. You can see that the fuel pump is there. Then I'm looking for the control wire and this is it right here. And it goes up to the integrated power module that's under the hood. So I'm looking if there's any fuse, not really, but I noticed that wire going from this to the fuel pump. The wire is a orange with a red. Goes from the front all the way to the fuel pump in the back. Orange with a red. So that's awesome. Let me find this wire. Now, being under the truck, that's the front up by the engine fuel tank. So we're going from the front to the back. If you look here, you'll see the wiring harness traveling going all the way back to the fuel pump. So if we hijack this harness, right in here and we are looking for an orange with a red just looking look big old orange wire look through the harness there's only one orange wire right here and then i'm looking and it has a red streak on the back of it so i am going to tap into this wire right here using my handy dandy tool when i'm done i'll put a little rtv in that little hole so we won't have any corrosion and then i use my power probe here fits right in I'm getting ground, that is fine, ground. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to cycle the key. I'm going to see if it gets power when I'm cranking. That way I know that everything is good up front, going all the way back to the fuel tank. So not saying that there couldn't be corrosion right on top of the fuel pump itself, but chances of that are slim, not impossible, but slim. So I'm going to check now, bear with me. We're getting power coming back there when we turn the key on. I'm going to drop this tank and inspect this fuel pump, possibly put a fuel pump in it. Chances are it is a fuel pump, but I just wanted to go through the process to kind of show you some of the things you should check and not ignore when you're diagnosing stuff, all right? Yeah, hear him talking, making nice again. All right, man, have a nice day. Bless you. Yeah.